Hey guys, I just got back from a fun trip uh, at whitefishing in Door County. I got back and I wanted to show you a couple different rigs I was using to help me catch the fish up there. Now I'm by no means a whitefish expert, but uh, the cool thing about whitefishing is you don't have to be an expert to actually go catch them. They're pretty easy to catch. So I've got a spoon rig that everyone uses up there, and i got another rig that I use for the days they're not eating the spoon. So let's dive into the one with the spoon first and then I'll show you the other one. Alright, first one is what everyone uses up there for the most part. You use a simple spoon like a Swedish pimple, I love gold, number two or number three. You attach that to a 6 pound main line and about 10 to 14 inches above the spoon I attach a swivel on line. Now what I did is since I'm allowed three lures in Wisconsin I actually went another 10 to 14 inches up above that swivel and tied on another swivel. So I've got two swivels in line here. Now above each swivel is a free sliding treble hook resting on top of that swivel. So when I'm down there thumping the bottom with the spoon and uh, trying to get fish to go on that, if they don't want to commit to the spoon they see two pieces of meat just kind of hovering above the spoon and a lot of your fishing will be taken on what they call the slider portion of that rig. So there's a slider rig with the spoon. It's the most common rig in Door County. It catches a lot of fish. It's pretty much all you need. But there are days when those fish don't want to eat the spoon and that's what this rig is for right here. Alright, now there are days when I'm out fishing and say the majority of the fish are coming on that slider rig. Those are really light bites and they're hard to detect on that type of ice fishing rod. So what I do is I bring another rod with me with a spring bobber built on the tip. And I actually go to what we call a sabiki rig. This is Rob Blosser's idea, by the way. He had a bunch of these sitting in his basement. We tried them out in Door County one day, and they worked really good. Um, a sabiki rig is a bait fish type rig used in the ocean to catch to catch small pieces of bait. But uh, we use them for whitefish now. We actually chop the sabiki rig in about half, so you have three different lures from the sabiki rig in line here. You go to a drop shot type sinker, a 3 16th, a quarter ounce, on the bottom. And above that I attach the main line to the Sibiki rig with a 12 pound Invisa swivel from Aquatico. It's the same swivel that I use on that double slider rig with the spoon. Um, so the, the Sibiki rig works really good. You actually let it down there, you thump up and stir up the bottom with the sinker, and when you start seeing fish in your locator come in, you actually let the sinker sit on the bottom and you let that spring bobber come back up after you take the tension off from the weight of the sinker. And with the spring bobber, even at 40, 60 feet of water, I can still see subtle bites that those whitefish, when they hit the Sibiki rig, but still have a nice, pretty fast action ice rig to get a good hook set once those fish are actually on. So a nice little finesse rig for the days when those fish don't want to commit to the spoon. Go to try the Sabiki rig. It's pretty fun. It's kind of a new way for us to fish those whitefish in Door County. Take both these rods with you. Have fun. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care.